hey everyone welcome to my video in this video i will uh, guide you how you can connect xbox controller to pc without bluetooth so let's not waste any more time and dive into the video so even though bluetooth is easy for connecting stuff wirelessly sometimes you might want to use other methods because not all pcs or laptops have bluetooth especially the older ones they might need extra adapters to get bluetooth working uh, bluetooth can sometimes make your gaming lag a bit which means there could be a tiny delay between pressing a button and seeing what happens in the game Using a wired connection or the Xbox wireless adapter can give you a smoother gaming feeling. So if you are uh, playing with friends on the same PC using the Xbox wireless adapter is easier because it lets you connect up to the 8 controllers at once. So the simplest way to connect your Xbox controller to your PC without Bluetooth is by using a USB cable. Most Xbox controllers have a USB cable you can use. First make sure your controller works with your PC, Xbox One and Xbox Series XS controller usually work with windows 11 and 10 so grab a usb uh, a to micro usb cable for xbox uh, one controllers or a usb a to usb c cable for xbox series controller so connect one end of the usb cable to your controller and the other end to the pc if it's your first time your pc should automatically set up the controller and look for the notification that says that your device is ready to make sure it's working you need to go to settings bluetooth and devices devices and your xbox controller should be listed there and uh, if you don't have a usb cable and you want a wireless connection without bluetooth you can use a xbox wireless adapter it lets you connect your xbox controller to your pc wirelessly even if you don't have bluetooth so buy the xbox wireless adapter it's a small usb dongle made for connecting xbox controller to a pc plug the adapter into a usb port on your pc and wait a bit for your pc to recognize it and turn on your xbox controller by pressing the button until it lights up press the pairing button on the adapter its light will flash showing it's ready to pair press and hold the pairing button on your computer when the light on both the controller and adapter uh, stays steady they are connected uh, to make sure your controller is connected, head you over to the settings, devices and devices and printers to check if your Xbox controller shows up there or not. So sometimes the usual ways to connect Xbox controller might not work. So uh, you need to use a third party software like Steam and DS4 Windows are solid picks. Uh, just make sure to download them from websites you can trust to keep away from nasty stuff like malware. So once you have downloaded it, open the software and do what it says. This often includes setting up how your controller button work with keyboard and mouse commands. So USB, um, or wireless adapters like uh, we talked about before uh, to connect your controller to your computer uh, in this software you just install you should be able to see your xbox controller press some buttons to check if the software respond or not so that is it for today's video i hope you like the video thank you for watching